the piece of it that I'm really concerned about is what's going on and what has been going on, uh, obviously, uh, within endemic areas of the world. As the virus mpox continues to spread in parts of Africa, is there a risk to the public here in Canada? Mpox first made global headlines in 2022 when the virus exploded around the world. Once again, the World Health Organization declared Mpox a global public health emergency last week as outbreaks continue in parts of Africa. Because this outbreak has really been left unchecked, because there's been such a failure for the global community to support uh, the DRC in terms of mobilizing vaccines and therapeutics, this outbreak has, has certainly mushroomed and now it's uh, impacting other countries. The virus spreads in different ways from person to person, from contact with contaminated objects and from animals to humans. People will present with fevers, they might have some swollen lymph nodes, but there's a pretty classic rash associated with this with like really uh, painful lesions on the body causes significant morbidity and even mortality sometimes. The Public Health Agency of Canada says the risk of mpox remains low. At this point there have been no new confirmed cases of mpox in Manitoba since the first confirmed case back in August 2022 but there have been confirmed cases in parts of the country including in Saskatchewan. From a global scale um, my concern is more about the, the perspective of we need to ensure people have not lost sight that mpox is still circulating in the community. The province of Manitoba says vaccines for mpox remain readily accessible across the province. One pharmacist we spoke to in Winnipeg says pharmacies at this point have not received any direction from the province in regards to the administration of the vaccine. If you're in a high risk uh, a group or, or a group that's at increased risk for infection, Go out, get vaccinated. If uh, if you're concerned about symptoms, please go and and uh, you know seek healthcare or assistance for testing. On Monday, Canada announced it will provide a million dollars to help stem mpox in Africa. In Winnipeg, Alex Carpa, City News.